Okay, we're back. Another location. And uh, you can see her. Oh, she can't see her through there. She's moved. Uh, we're in a place called um, Wig Rams. Yeah, Wig Rams. Funny name. Oh, Wig Rams. Can't, can't say it right. <laughs> but it, it is actually Wig Rams. I'll put it across it. That is how you say it. And it's actually uh, where you can stay for the night. And uh, not only that, there's not many spaces by the way, just a few. Um, but also it's next to this great big marina which um, there's a gate over there so I'm going to go through the gate and we'll see if we can see from there but we'll see from here, see if you can see it. It's a bit of a fence in the way but we'll see. Canal right next to us, which of course is handy because we're going to take uh, Raven Girl magnet fishing because we've got her here with us this time. So, um, but yeah, um, in the distance over that direction up there and over that direction, there's some terrific views. Um, it'd be better if we was higher up rather than the level we're on, but you can tell there's lots of beautiful grassland up there beautiful place so uh, what I'm gonna do I'm gonna show you now the way we came in I can't go right to the end because it's quite a long road I'm gonna show you what we had to uh, contend with <laughs> in the night time as well when we arrived because it was night time and uh, yeah I'll show you around the area so let's go so you can see a much better view from standing over here Beautiful. We're in a boat slung there. There's a car park over there for the people who no doubt live on the boats. Place to park the cars as well as where I've just walked by. Oh, and that house over in the distance there is, I think, is the, I think he's the owner of everything that's here. As far as I know, anyway, he's the chap we had to pay. So <laughs> I hope he's the owner. We had, we paid him last night. So anyway, I just want to show you the. Uh, this is the entrance road we came in. So uh, have a look at this. over there look that's nice isn't it a few houses look on top of the hills look very nice you see some woods in the distance look <laughs> these potholes are unreal <laughs> unbelievable and last night I'll show you a bit of footage and this was what it was like last night coming down here in the dark trying to avoid these potholes <laughs> oh look at these oh, beautiful oh look at them beautiful oh Hello, hello. So I was ain't gonna bother them. Hello. <laughs> hello. Oh, look at these, and the beautiful. Hello, it's okay. Hello. <laughs> oh, beautiful. 
<laughs> Insane, get away from him. Evil human. Oh, and some more over there, look. It's time of the year. Time of the year for the little lambs. Oh, and they're beautiful. <laughs> So let's carry on having a little walk along here and uh, I can see the canal look and there's the you can see the road bridge in the distance there that's where we came over before we had a very sharp turn to the right to come down here look at these potholes <laughs> this has to be the worst ever road we've ever been along to get to a place where we're gonna park up for the night this is terrible look at them and you can see look it's just a massive long road to get all the way to where we are and it's just nothing but huge potholes so uh, not not a good uh, <laughs> it's not a good advert for the place but it's a, it's a shame because you know other than that it's okay got all the facilities that we want and uh, well I don't think they've got laundry I don't think but Otherwise, yeah, it's all right. It's just, it's a shame about these potholes. And Jan did actually have a word with him when she arrived because she, she don't mess about, does Jan? And she said, uh, you know, what, what, what about all these potholes then? And he, and he actually said that it's to do with the weather, said that all the rains brought them about, which, yeah, it can do that. The rain does do that, does it? It's the normal tarmac roads. But I tend not to believe it because some of these seem like they've, I think they've been here for a long time. But anyway, it's there anyway. But, uh, the highlight for me at the minute is the uh, little lambs. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. But this is the, uh, the joys of being on the road, seeing different places, meeting different people, and all, all, the, uh, all the animals you see, absolutely amazing. It's lovely, I love it. So where we are is here, I'll put it along gear now. This is the address of where this is, if you do want to stay here. It uh, costs us £16 a night and that includes LSAN, fresh water, toilets, I think there's a shower as well. I don't think there's any laundry, I don't think, um, not at all. <coughs> but, um, but yeah get this side so you can see me and see the lambs um, but yeah 16 pound a night mm, mm. I mean don't get me wrong I think we've been on better ones that's 13 pound a night but it's still you know it's there if you want to you know empty your toilet and stay just for one night we're stopping for just two nights but the only reason we're stopping two nights is because a raven girl and a magnet fishing um, if it weren't for that we wouldn't probably have come here there's, there's other places that we probably would have gone to although this is not terrible uh, this is not a bad advert for them at all by any stretch of the imagination it's actually all right i quite like it but i'm just saying there is there's even better if you want better but there's a lot worse as well so you can't go far wrong it's not it's not too bad not too bad but there's a hell of a lot of people here so many boats i mean there's them along there, which I've uh, just showed you, the back of me there. And then there's these marinas, one there and one back here as well. I mean, good God, there's no end of boat people around here. It's an extremely busy area for boats. But, uh, but yeah, so what I'll do now, I'm gonna go and have a look at the canal, because I haven't actually been down yet. There's a gate right behind our van. So uh, it's gonna take me a a few minutes to walk back so uh, I'll be back in a second.
So there we go. There's a bit of a, a view what it's like just uh, outside our van. There's our van through these bushes. I don't know if you can see it or not. You can just make it out. It's just there. And that, the gate is just there. So uh, I can just go through the gate and straight into the van. But there you go. That's the marina. There's uh, people over there watching me. They were. <laughs> this one which you've just seen and uh, yeah lovely isn't it very nice that's the view of the other end look quite a few boats going back and forth it would be wouldn't it it's a marina so but yeah beautiful absolutely beautiful so yeah lovely isn't it 16 pound a night would you stay here that's the question yeah why not lovely lovely and uh, it is a quiet place as well uh, so there you go. Uh, there is oh yeah. There's uh, if you do come here, you have to watch out for the chickens because apparently they <laughs> they do run loose around the yard, around where we are. So uh, and that's something we have to watch out for, Charlie. And there's a few cats because uh, when we uh, came last night, I went to let him out, uh, put him on his lead. And as soon as I opened the door, he went to launch out the door because there was a cat sat right outside our step, which is is not a very good idea <laughs> when Charlie's around. So, uh, but yeah, Look really nice, yeah. So that's it, signing off, and uh, join me on the next trip to another place, and uh, I'll see you all soon. Ta-da.